I'm from Perry McClure and this is my project. Um, what I decided to do was I decided to determine if dogs have a dominant paw, like humans have a dominant hand, if they use one more than the other. So what I did was I did some research about it and a lot of different studies and colleges said that they do, so I decided to test it myself. So um, I found uh, five different tests that you can do that it's supposed to help you determine if they have a right or left dominant paw. And um, the first one was I had to like hold a treat out and see which one they would like use, which paw they would use. The other one, I would put a piece of like adhesive, like tape, on their nose or their head and see which paw they use, like try to get it off. Um, then the first step test where you see which one they used to take their first step when they start walking and put a treat in a like rubber tube and see which one they hold still while they try to get it out and put it in the bottom of a tall glass and try and see. So I tested seven different dogs and all but one of them showed that they used one paw a lot more than the other. It was very obvious for all except one dog. The other dogs didn't really respond to any of the tests. But for the most part, I concluded that yeah, they do have a more dominant paw. So dogs are not ambidextrous. They no. prefer one paw over the other. And you must yeah. be an animal lover too. Yes. All right, were you in the dog yours? Your one dogs? of them was. Yeah, the first one was. That's these fun. pictures. These are my friend's dogs, but yeah, it's fun. Well, that was really interesting. Thank you so much, and good luck with your project. And, and I was going to ask you also: this is your first year at Governor's School? Yes. And how do you like it so far? Um, I like it. I like. It's very challenging, but I, it's a good environment because everyone here is really, um, they're respectful and they are trying hard to learn, so it's just a room full of kids that all are trying hard and paying attention to class, but it's very challenging and it's a lot of work, but it's okay. Good preparation for life. Yeah. Well, thank you so much and good luck with your project. Thank you. Thank you.